In 1994, the Somerville Community Growing Center started out as a vacant sand pit on an old school lot in one of the densest and most diverse cities in the nation. Thanks to help from visionary neighbors, this forlong site was transformed into an urban oasis. Located in Somerville, Massachusetts, this quarter acre community built public park today functions as an urban forest, a sustainability education center, and a community backyard. Managed by the Friends of the Community Growing Center, an all volunteer nonprofit organization, the Growing Center offers a site where residents of all ages and ethnic backgrounds are able to gather and share experiences in a natural setting. With a focus on environmentalism and innovative agricultural practices, the Growing Center strives for inclusivity and sustainability while generating civic pride. It's a dynamic, up-and-coming city full of new faces and economic development, Somerville reaps the benefits of higher-paying jobs and a better-educated population. Issues such as finding affordable rents or managing the city's stormwater can pose risk for places like the Growing Center to be swept aside, and affordable housing often means small backyards. By offering a space where the nature thrives, the Growing Center provides a unique spot where children can learn and play, residents can unwind, join in a community sing-along, or just read and meditate. Longtime Somerville resident Lisa Brucolaccio was one of the initiators of the Growing Center. Through her passion and leadership and that of other board members, the Friends of the Community Growing Center advocated to make sure the site, as the result of a community design process in 1993, would remain a gem in this up-and-coming city. Recognizing a need to upgrade and improve the infrastructure and landscape to better serve the public for decades to come, the Grand Center found a partner in the nonprofit regenerative design consulting firm, Terra Kira. As a small volunteer-based nonprofit, the Friends of the Community Growing Center lacked the capital for a redesign and renovation of the park. In 2014, a partnership was formed where the Friends collaborated with Terra Kira to design the project scope and a budget for the future of the Growing Center and being able to capitalize on the launch of the Community Preservation Act in 2015 with the first round of funding, we collectively submitted an application to the city of Somerville, and it was funded. With the funding in hand, the Friends worked with Terra Cura, who helped to facilitate what's called the placemaking process. This design process aimed to create multiple levels of resilience for a changing future, both socially, environmentally, and economically. Key to understanding and meeting community needs was an interactive visioning charrette, a series of public meetings where residents were invited to share their ideas. Participants in this process offered many suggestions, hopes, and dreams. Identified goals centered around maintaining functions, such as natural playscape for children, a sustainability education center, and an incubator for community connection. Keeping to its mission, the Growing Center will continue to be accessible to all cultures and creed. Over the course of 18 months and a dozen community engagement activities, including public design charrettes and meetings with city staff and industry experts, the site was designed around the potential of ecosystem regeneration. It builds upon the existing essence of the Growing Center as an urban wild and organic oasis. As the site infrastructure outlived its lifespan, one of the main goals was to design improvements that restored the damaged features. A core organizing principle was to work with a 16-foot change in site elevation to capture and direct the flow of water on site and accent the diverse microhabitats. Innovative solutions include the use of permeable black locust paving and thousands of plugs of native and adapted species that are ornamental and edible plantings to reduce the stormwater runoff. The primary focus of the integrative design is on urban agriculture and how the entire food system from source, production, management, distribution, and waste capture can be nested within the growing center and in turn be nested within the Somerville community. Design considerations were made to increase the overall use of the space while maintaining the long-term manageability by the community. A crumbling wooden retaining wall needed replacement at the center. Terracura devised a long-term solution requiring minimal new resources. Salvage 19th century bluestone from a local foundation otherwise a waste was acquired with the support from a local developer and physical help from Groundwork Somerville's green team. Youth Build USA, another local nonprofit that trains low income youth in construction skills, was enlisted to build the wall. This low tech solution, a modular gabion wall system, allowed the community to take on the build process, cultivating stewardship for the center and bonds amongst the community members. Topped with a bench made with invasive but sustainable black locust wood, 
a simple wall became a long-lasting gathering node with excellent structural capacity, water drainage quality, and an educational feature for sustainable building technique. Throughout the design process, various representatives from the city of Somerville were involved. From coming up with a creative design for the future siting of a composting toilet, to gaining a better understanding of the municipal bidding process. The Growing Center redesign benefited from engagement with the parks, sustainability, health and human services, and planning departments. Partners such as the Community Outreach Group and Mass Arborists leveraged their resources of industry professionals to contribute to the design process as well. Ultimately, the Growing Center is more than a collection of innovative ecological functions. The essence of this place is about providing a site to cultivate a field of caring through connection with growing food and nature, a site that encourages imagination and explorative learning through play and relaxation. So why is the Growing Center different? Challenging the norms of typical playgrounds, individually owned community garden plots, and open ballparks, the Growing Center offers a new typology for urban parks. It is at once an urban food forest, a shared backyard, a community nursery, and an open source learning platform for urban agriculture.